Hi, I'm Paula Todd. Today I'm going to take you through a couple of blocks of choreography for use with older adult classes. The choreography I'm going to show you, you might think it's a little too complicated for your classes. If so, please look for the simpler options. Take out the turns, for example, or reduce the arm lines. But if you feel that your class is capable of, capable of using the choreography I'm showing you, go for it. We're going to take a zigzag forward. Let's go. Easy walk, step knee, and slow pivot. Let's do that again. Zigzag, left hand side. So reach up high. Easy walk, face in the front. Step knee, slow pivot. Let me show you an easier version. We'll go for a, a grapevine to the sides. Simple arms. Stick with your easy walk. Add your step knee and march and hold. Simpler again, go left. Two steps. So this is for your participants who might not be quite so active. You can reduce your range of motion on your Easy walk and step knee and march on the spot. Let's look at the first again. So you're going to zigzag forward. Nice big arm line if your shoulders are healthy. Easy walk, step knee and then pivot. Okay, one more time. Zigzag to the left and take it back. An easy walk. Step knee, now pivot or march on the spot as you prefer. Now we're going to hold. Holding patterns are very useful when you're working with older adults. Gives them a chance to catch their breath. Gives them, gives them a chance to just take a bit of a break with the brain. Let's go through the second combination. We're going to start with two steps to the right. We're making a wedge shape. Travelling forward, single, single, double leg curls and a march back in a circle. To the left, double step. To the corner, so see that wedge shape. Bring it forward, single, single, double and march a circle back. Let's simplify. So double step, with or without your arms or you can just keep the arms low. I'd still like you to come forward on that single, single, double and maybe just march straight backwards. Okay, now we'll take it to the left. Double step. Don't do the wedge, just stay straight across. So I'm showing you the simpler options. Single, single, double for those participants in your classes who aren't quite up to all the turns and so on. But let's put it together back to the start. We'll use the wedge this time. To the corner and try to press up nice and strongly. Coming forward, single, single, double. Circle back. You could even jog this part if you wanted to. Last time. Take it to the corner. Coming forward now, single, single, double. And circle back, go, go. 